Okay, this is Buck Raji back at you. Um, I've had some questions about the betting style of the true chop, true trend method. Okay, so it's a combination of De La Bering and Martin Gelling. So we'll go through this a little bit slowly. So the first thing we do is fresh deck, we just deal. Right now, player one, we're going to play banker. Our base unit is five dollars. If we win, we keep playing the chop. We lose, we play the chop four times, then we go for the trend. I'm going to go for a 10 chip win. Dealer bearing is every time you lose, you add chip. Every time you win, you, you take a chip away. Or if I win at $15, I take it back down to base bet. Kind of money management. Otherwise, these bets will get too high. So far, we haven't had a trend. And the chop has been working just Great for us. This is just an RNG practice. I will. I'll be going to Boomtown. That's a casino in uh, Reno, Nevada, and I will should be able to. to uh, according to them, I can videotape just my play. All right. So now we take it back down. Keep playing. Banker side. Go up a chip because we lost. Down chip because we won. Unusually good shoe for us so far. Okay, hopefully we lose this one. Uh, shoot. Okay, we, we will. It's going to happen. I want to show you the, the second leg to the system. So we're going to lose this one. Ugh. Well... Very choppy shoe, which is unusual to be this choppy. We're past our goal, but I'm just trying to get some losses racked up here so I can show you the other part of it. Dealer bearing, we're going up a chip. Going up a chip. Let's lose this one. Finally. All right, now we've got four in a row. Big question is how do I do my betting strategy? Well, it's a combination of Martin Gelling and De La Bering. So now <clears throat> the chop's done. We go for the trend. We're gonna Martin Gel, which would be thirty bucks, but I add a chip to that, and we go for the trend. That's thirty-five. Now, we're, if we win, we go back down to base bet. Just one, back down to base bet. We'll go for hundred dollars. Keep playing the chip, the chop, I mean. Yeah, it's just a really good shoe, and you'll have shoes like this that just go really good for your system. A good Baccarat player will change up systems because all systems will fail. Okay. Lost that one. Dealer bearing. Dealer bearing. Let's lose this one. Come on. Lose, 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 lose. Ah, we won. Lost it. Keep playing the chop. Lost it. Chop again. Won it. Now, 
dealer bearing, normally you're just going to have $10, right? But I don't believe in that. you, you got to use some money management. So take your bets all the way back down as soon as you can. Always go back, race back down to base bet. Take some losses if you have to. Perfect. Four in a row. We Martingale. 15, 30, plus one. We won. We can now take about, yeah, and we keep playing the trend. Hopefully we get a dragon. Nope. Pay the chop, and we hit a hundred bucks. I hope this helps explain. I've had some comments, which I appreciate the comments. Please comment. Um, I really enjoy that. Um, it's a great system. Now every system has its problems. If you get four patterns in a row out of four patterns, you have a problem. Now remember my other system where I wait for three and we go for six. We would have won here. One here, lost, one, one, and one. So that's a very powerful system. Anyway, quick hundred bucks. I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, this this is I this is by far my best system. It just does well. You just need a healthy bankroll, you know, to withstand the inevitable, which is you're going to have four patterns. We'll go for another 50 bucks real quick. See if we can't get ourselves in some trouble. It's easy to show when things are good. Mm -hmm. Could hit 150 without a problem. Or we might run into a little bit of trouble. I'd rather run into trouble. Come on, lose this one. Nope. You, you won't find a channel like this where I actually want things to go badly to show you how to get out of that problem because you'll you will hit it a problem what's nice about playing at a place like you know a brick and mortar casino that's regulated by the government I would have no I will have no problem playing this they have actually at, in boomtown they actually have a, a, a slot machine that's got blackjack, it's got bock raw, it's got craps and roulette. That is a game I would trust. Online gambling, no. We never trust our RNG on online gambling. No bueno. It's not regulated. This is a good RNG to practice on because it's not. This is not real money. So it's going to give you a feel for what's really going to happen. Well, don't want to keep the video too long. Dealer bearing. We add a chip. Um, looks like we're going to make 150 pretty easy. See that? It's boom, 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 easy. Again, uh, three pattern, we would have won on my other system. So either either, either system would have been doing really good in this particular scenario. Now when you had money, you could do this. You could up your bets. See if we can't make this to 250. Oh, I love it. Love it. Ah, made it. See, we can make 250. Deal the bearing, adding a chip. Going back down to base bet as soon as we can. Adding a chip, playing the chop. Now we'll go for the trend. Hopefully, we lose this one. Good. Now, we're going to go 150. Plus a chip. Good, we lost. Next bet's going to be for 200 This is where I wanted to show you. All right, so $200 here. 
We won. Take down to 175. We lost. Back to 200. We lost. 225. This is good stuff. Now we've got to go to 450. 450 plus 75. This is where it gets good. All right, now we won. We're playing the trend. So we got to take it back down to two, uh, 250. Okay. Loss. Back up. One. Back down to 250. If we went at 250, we didn't. God, this is great. This is great. See how this can get out of control? So 300, got to go 600, and 25. All right, take it back down to 300. Go for that trend. Two seventy five. Back up to three hundred. Back down to seventy five. If we win this one, we should be able to go back down to base bet. Didn't. Oh, this is great. This is absolutely perfect. Back down three hundred. 300. Two seventy five. Lost it. Three hundred. Made it. Two seventy five. And boom. Four hundred bucks down. Then you would take it back down. To base bet okay so you get yourself in trouble and you get yourself out of trouble as soon as you can so this was a, gr a great uh session to show you that this is ch this challenge for real once i start a session i don't stop it i'm not going to make it look good and easy wins every time because it's not you get at the table now Personally, I would not play twenty-five chips, even with ten thousand ten thousand dollar bankroll. Wouldn't do it. Five bucks is plenty. You can make lots of money. Just wanted to show you that if you want to play bigger units, you, know, you can. But I would have a bigger bankroll of ten grand because you saw where the bets get a little bit crazy. It's a great system. It has not filled me yet. I mean, at some point it's going to because you know what all systems do. But so far, so good. But I would not feel comfortable at this level, this level for sure. Okay, this is Bach Raji. I hope this kind of helped explain what I'm doing. Um, let's go with my six system where we hit three over six. So we were lost, lost, one, broke even. Lost, 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 been in trouble. Then we went a one here. So the, the shoe's early, but. Wouldn't be doing all that bad right now. Okay? All right. This is Bakraji signing off.